I just put a Twitter post out. I'm gonna get help from the community because I want to find out why this isn't growing. Any reason why this wouldn't grow? Oh, it grew! Never mind. Delete that tweet. We're fine. We're totally fine. Literally, it's been up for one second, <laughs> as you can see. Hey, what's going on, dudes? It's Mitch or Bajan Canadian here, coming at you with some ghetto redstone science. This is going to be farming in the hood with your boy Bajan Canadian here today. I appreciate you all tuning in back for an episode of Cosmic Sky. And behind me, there there are some shenanigans about to go down. First of all, shout out to the homie Brandon right here. He's been helping me tend to the fat of the land and uh, making sure that I don't have to break myself and stay up past 5 a.m., which has kind of become the new routine the last few days. I, I get to go to bed at 5 in instead of, like, 6 as I go to slap all my quotas up. So we've been grinding that the last two days, but we're here. And I've got to show you guys this ghetto redstone machine. Shoutouts to Doc M. Link in the video details this video for the tutorial. I got to give him credit because there's no way your boy could come up with this on his own. But I'm going to modify it to make it fit Cosmic Sky and make it even more AFK productive. This thing is going to be stupidly automated it's go smash a like on this i appreciate your faces oh boy let me let me show you guys a few other details though look at my balance i've got two million left that's it i'm broke i'm poor because i'll show you my pvs i've been making some hefty investments i've got all of these melon recipes and i really hope my melon recipe monopoly pays off because i leave in two days by the time you've seen this video i've probably already left now anyways uh, I'm getting getting sidetracked. Hopefully my melon monopoly pays off. That's all I'm gonna say. I've got I got like 25 recipes. I'm gonna try and buy more before I leave. That's where all my cash flow is going. Besides the Nether Ward recipe, your boy bought the recipe for 45 million. Yes, I did. I had to cop it. It was on on sale. Most people are listing them at like 50. So I bought it for 45. It's been redeemed. We can now farm nether wart on the island. I'm pretty sure I have the biggest and most bad farms in all of the packs. So hashtag YouTube top, you know what's up. So our beetroots, we've we've grinded that. Look at our quotas are boosting up. We've done that. We've done that. We've done that. We've done that. Look at our quotas. We're doing it. Now nether wart, we've just unlocked. We did enough beetroot farming. We got the recipe. We're ready. Now the thing is, this machine right here is for nether warts. So let me explain it real quick. We got observers here that observe the growth of the nether wart in the three stages of growth, which is why I have four blocks here. Because once I place one of my nether warts on here, it's going to instantly consume one of these cobblestones and it's going to shoot up into the other dropper above. Whew. Now, once this has grown one, two, three states, all of these will be moved to the top, which is then going to cause these observers to observe the change. And boom, this piston's going to shoot down, slam dunk the nether wart, crush it, and this piston will then do a reset and shove all four blocks back down here. And then, yeah, this uh, this will no longer have another wart, but I will be moving our auto planter, which is down here. This will be the, the final form of the science once we've confirmed it's working. The auto planter, I will move it from here because this was just a testing facility. I'm going to move it up here and we will expand this and have more lines on this side and eventually more on the other side. The nether wart replanter in the center and he'll be planting. I'll have an auto collection chest, which is in my PV. Oh no, it's down here. I tested it. Yeah, let me show you guys this. This is a collection chest. I'm going to program it so that it only collects, right? So it's going to grab all those each time the pistons punch it off of the block. This, this science is getting real, real. I'll tell you. Real, real. Really freaking real. So what's going to happen is this will absorb it. So we'll have boom, 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 boom. All these nether warts will be coming in the collection chest, right? And then it's going to go through a hopper. And I wanted to make sure hoppers could take items out of collection chest. Instead of going into this chest, it'll go in to the auto planter bot, who will then replant the nether wart on an infinite loop and we're gonna get rich how much does another wart sell for sell hand oh wait no i need to oh, that would have been bad thank goodness i realized that that would have been a big mistake sell sell hand four thousand dollars for each and every nether wart which isn't bad and i wonder if there's a if, was there a recipe here with another wart? oh my god the rotten flesh the undead mushroom three nether wart and a rotten flesh so that's gonna go really nicely with my zombie spawners which i now also can place down i've got them here i haven't used them yet how many do i have though spiders zombies I have five zombie spawners oh wait no we got six zombie spawners we got a lot of spiders we gotta sort out too i actually also need to do my kit so let's grab that rank kit level 10 four zombie spawners that's actually huge you can get a maximum of five 
five. So we'll take that. And a bunch of stuff here that I don't care about. And how much is our eco? 2.2 million. That's actually big. We need that. And I think that was all we got. Oh, we got this. Boss Slayer. Who cares? We ain't slaying no bosses. Let's be honest. We're farmers out here. We live off the fat of the land. We've described how this works. Now we're going to put it in action. Let's test this out. We plant. That caused this to update. And as this grows, each time it grows, it'll cause an update loop. So while we're waiting on that to function, what I'm going to do is build a second one here for you guys. And hopefully I don't scuff this too badly. So we're taking our soul sand. We're going to build a bunch, actually. We're going to build it out this far for now. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's see. What is our radius on our little planter down here? What you doing, buddy? Let's check. I'm going to grab him and beetroot seeds. Honestly, I'm I'm just going to sell hand. I, I, I'm sure this is going to give me one each. Oh, no. Yeah, one each. Useless. I could a AH these a AH sell 25,000 people will buy it I should be doing that honestly with all these extra stacks dude I have stupid amounts of beetroot seeds let me show you my supply zone a full double chest did I already sell it okay I thought I already sold let's actually check I'm curious what these are selling for because I could make some extra coin real quick because I'm poor now so I need that beetroot seeds where are they now oh, here we go lowest price oh they go real cheap never mind 25k yeah I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it anyways because I don't even feel like dealing with it our auto planter I'm gonna just place him right here for now should be fine let's see his radius though the radius is four by four so one two three four i'm gonna move him over one more just so i don't have to deal with it because i don't feel like having to build more on the other side i want to just go one direction as i place a million more observers down so we're grabbing our we have no more quotes i'm pretty sure i put it in storage but that's fine we'll, we'll buy some more we got we still have money we got four mil again we're fine and I got a lot of chests of stuff I could sell. Like, look at this. Could sell those, could sell those, could sell those, could sell those. <laughs> I got money. I ain't worried about no money. <laughs> we actually have too much money. It's disgusting. Okay, so one, two, three, four, and the center, and then one, two, three, four. Perfect. And now we begin. We're going to put down, as these are called, helper blocks. And shout outs to the redstone masters. That way we are lining this all up, bring this across as well. Those are the blocks that we need. And I'm gonna do the same thing here. Just get all of our basic blocks placed. There we go, that's our quartz. And then we're gonna take our pistons. We're gonna bring this across all the way. This is the design, guys. If you wanna, if you wanna go for it, give me a little bit of that street hood redstone credit, okay? I'm slaving away out here. And then you want this to go the other way. So we need to face it like that, actually. So I need to destroy all these. Whoop. All of these have to go for the moment. We'll rebuild you after. Because we want these to be facing backwards so that they're checking for the correct updates. So now all that is lined up correctly. And then we want the opposite on these ones. We want them coming this way. So we want to make sure the arrows are going the correct direction. So that is what I'm try oh, trying to do. These pistons are tripping out. I know. It's okay, pistons. You're going to be fine. And then on this side, I need to put myself a little helper block all the way along the bottom. And I'll break these after because what I want is I want these droppers facing up. And then I will collect the items after. We could actually have left this block. It doesn't really matter. But either way, then we're going to come back like so. There we go. And we have our helper blocks as they're called in the business. And we put these down like this. Now that we have achieved our goals and life's ambitions on that way, we got more. <laughs> I've invested in this redstone contraption. I will, I promise you, I punted. I spent like six mil on all of these redstone things. So this better work out for me. Otherwise, I'm going to cry. All right. So that's looking all mwah, magnifique. And then what we're going to need to do is take some more quartz. <laughs> What did I do wrong? What did I... Uh, maybe I got to put the block on top first. Maybe that's why. Let's try it. Something went horribly wrong, guys. <laughs> maybe I have to put the... Where did we all go? You know what? I think I need to put the repeaters second. Give me a second. Problem solved. We need to put some items inside the bottom ones. My bad. You got to start with the items in here, okay? You got to put four in each. Let me do that now before I scuff this again. One, two, three, four. Make sure I get all of those update ticks involved because once I plant the first one down, that will count as a tick. So just four in each of these. Make sure those are in. That was what I had done wrong. The repeaters or comparators or torches didn't matter the order. It's purely because there was nothing in this, which was making it so the comparator was not receiving any signal. That's my bad. That is totally my bad, but we have fixed it. Problem solved. I'm a detective. Easy game. Redstone king of the world, baby. You know, you know who to call if you need some redstone tips. It's not me, but you can, you can enjoy this quality content nonetheless. And I hope for those of you who are redstone masters, I hope this is making you a little bit impressed because this is a big deal for me. And I got to put all my repeaters back down that I smashed because I wasn't sure where I went wrong at first, but we're fine. Beautiful. Those are all in. That's the whole build, guys. 
Now we plant more nether wart. And why plant it myself when I have this man? Boom! Plant that for me. Yeah! You do the job. You do the dirty work. Ha ha! Wait. Oh no. That's not good. Maybe I only need three blocks? For this one? Is this one updated? Yikes. I think with the auto planter, it doesn't count. Hold on, let me test something. I'm a little I'm a little nervous actually now. If I put it myself, what's going on here? Oh, it's oh, I see why. So I actually need to put three in each of these instead of four because I'm manually doing it. It's fine. It's because when the planter does it, it's, it's not updating the observer because it's a different type of mechanic that vanilla Minecraft does not recognize. Obviously, it's custom. All right, and then we take this one out because we only need three, in fact, now because our planter is a bouse. And he's going to plant this all up for me without me having to worry. And I want this stuff to grow. It hasn't grown at all. Is there something special you got to do on Cosmic to make these things grow? Uh, I'm going to ask the global chat. Let's see. Have I done something horribly wrong? To grow nether wart, is there something special you need? <laughs> Hood farmers don't. Soul sand, yeah. Okay. I have soul sand. No lighting needed. But these haven't grown at all. None of them. It's making me nervous. Do you need... <laughs> what are these people... No glowstone. Glowstone makes it grow faster. Light doesn't affect the growth of nether wart. Glowstone speeds it up. Okay, so that seems like a bit of a myth. These people are all contradicting each other, but it's not growing. It's like, I guess, super slow to grow. Well, we gotta... Gotta wait for it to grow. Because I, I really do want to see this, this take effect. I want to see this work. It's really slow right now, though. My planter is ready. He wants to go to town. Either way, while we're waiting on this to happen, um, I'm going to go ahead real quick here. And I'm going to actually move him back one just to be safe. I don't want to risk this scuffing because of like observers interacting somehow in a way that they shouldn't. And then I'm going to go up like this and I'm going to put a hopper right there. But I want the hopper to go down actually. So I need to do this. Oh no! If that had fell off the edge, I would have I would have lost my sh and I need to get my hoppers. They should be in here. In here? Where did I put my I need the collection chest too actually. So I'll just grab all this. This is all I need right here. Easy dubs. Pick this up. Get the chest. I don't even need this actual chest, but we'll hold on to it for now. I'll definitely need to make some kind of overflow system later, but for now this will do. Is this is this growing? None of this has grown yet. I'm I'm getting a little concerned, honestly. Either way, we put the hopper down and we put our collection chest onto it, and we're gonna set it so that it grabs nether wart. And then when we check the settings, it grabs nether wart and nothing else. What's concerning is that this isn't growing. Shop. Let's buy some glowstone. See if this is true. We'll put it to the test. I don't think so. 500 each, just by like that much. Don't think this plays any role. I'm gonna say, just put a Twitter post out. I'm gonna get help from the community because I want to find out why this isn't growing. Any reason why this wouldn't grow? Oh, it grew! Never mind. Delete that tweet. We're fine. We're totally fine. Literally, it's been up for one second, <laughs> as you can see. Deleted it. We're fine. We're golden. It's a fantastic day. I'm, I'm, I'm honestly ecstatic right now, guys. Let's, let's see if we can check. Oh, it's beautiful. Look at those. Can we sneak in here? Two. It's got two left. Now we just gotta stare at this for a little while longer. Maybe the glowstone did help. <laughs> like I'm not, I'm not sure. Maybe it did.